Hello ladies and gentlemen, Sigval Grim here and welcome back to another video. As usual, you, my lovely subscribers, have blessed me with some more chest openings. Again, if you open a chest, record it and submit it to my Discord server. And I can make a compilation out of it and we can enjoy them together. And that's exactly what we're going to take a look at today. The Cyber Monday chest opening. So all the links to all the videos will be in the description. Thank you so much for submitting them and let's get into it. Let me uh, do the... Um, uh, two times speed and yeah, there we go Okay, let's get into it. So first up I got some bed and laps here That's gonna be one chest nothing. Those are banshee shards again. Not the worst thing possible. There's some firestorm in there There is some Predator Batman. Not too bad and finally some legendary shards. Let's get 200. Let's go Let's go. The man is moving on to the next chest. He's promoting his black manta now. Again, Battle Blast will not see that much of a difference in damage and in performance from a star rating to star rating, but when it comes to uh, Manta, it will be quite different. But Battle Blast, 3 stars is enough, same with Deathstroke. Okay, not, not much so far here. There's some EPI in there, 40 shards, not, not totally a waste at least. Some more Silver Banshee yet again, getting, getting towards that 7 star mark. More Sub-Zero. Reverse Flash, that's that's pointless. Pointless again. Come on, man. Give the man some legendaries. Also, the one openings are not only on two times speed. They're a little bit more because I speeded them up in edit, not only on YouTube. But yeah, there we go. Some more EPI shards at least. I'm trying to see the bright side here. But uh, talking about the bright side, there we go. That's 200. Oh, boy. That makes, makes up... Or all the openings so far and all the golds that are to come in like the next 20 openings. Those 200 shards are really something. Boy, the sale was so good. I think this is the best sale I've ever seen in just T-Mobile. Cyber Monday and uh, Black Friday of this year. Or sort of Banshee were there and 75 shards. That's not too bad. I don't think anybody's gonna complain about 75 shards. Take them and leave. Some more garbage. I mean, speed for the splash was not max, but I'm not sure if he was in a hurry to max him, and there we go. Another legendary drop, 75 more shards. Slow and steady, slow and steady. And uh, I think he's definitely getting a good ratio when it comes to uh, gold to legendary so far. At the very least, uh, that's how it seems to me. Okay, that's some uh, flash in there. More horrific scarecrow, I don't think he cares about that. And another legendary drop, let's go. 50 more shards, 50 more shards, definitely steady. Boy, I haven't looked at it really like I glimpsed through it, but in this video, th there might be the most unlucky chest opening that you guys have seen in your lives. Yes, I'm talking about you, Mahmoud. I haven't really seen this, I only scanned through it when I did the editing, but we're going to take a look at that because that man allegedly spent 40k gems and literally got no legendary shard drops. And here, the luck seems to have run out for a bit. I haven't seen uh, legendary drops in quite a while. Come on, my dudes. I stop giving this man Starfire. Does he really look like he needs that? Okay, some more Nightwing in there. And there you go, finally another legendary drop. 50 more shards. Again, slow and steady. It's already 4 stars. You reached the 4 star threshold there. With that Manta drop. Hopefully he's able to get him to 5 stars. To 5 stars is where you really start dealing damage with Manta. Uh, at 4 stars it's yet again a big threshold because it's gonna be far easier for you than at 3 stars to maintain the passive while tagging in and out. So you have that option. Even at 3 stars you can in theory maintain the passive and still tag in and out. But that's gonna be a nightmare to manage. Some more API shards in there. Yeah, 5 stars is a sweet spot, 6 stars is the perfect spot. Like, 7 stars is also good, don't get me wrong, you want that additional damage from super move, you want that additional attack. But the biggest difference is gonna be all the way to 6 stars. 7 stars, it's it's fine if you can do that, don't get me wrong. He's some more ace green arrow, no, no. I think that this man needs, and... Seems like he's got a lot of characters actually promoted to a high star rating, so it's quite unlikely that he needs anything other than Urbanshi and DPI, so yeah. Lot of garbage drops for this man. And some good ones. 
Cheetah in there, we haven't seen her in a while. Did you guys miss Cheetah? Okay, that's some more Cheetah, let's go! Dark Supergirl, he doesn't need that, he doesn't need Blue Beetle. That's some grid in there. Okay, he's back in there. Just went out of it and entered and pressed that again. People do some of those kinds of things. There, there's people in people when it comes to chest openings. There's people who always open 10 times. There's people who always open one time. There's people who open one time and then 10 times. There's people who go and open the basic chest in between the openings. Do you know which one of them works? None of them, as far as I'm aware. The only thing that allegedly works... There we go, not a legendary one. How many shards? 100, not too bad. The only thing that allegedly works when it comes to opening chests to get better luck is to open the uh, legendary chests um, or pretty much any chest that we want to drop uh, some gems on, 100 more shards, so let's go. It's to open them one hour after they are put in the store in that time frame. Do not open them later than one hour after they are put in the store. Or if you miss that time frame to wait until the next day, to wait 24 more hours. After they're put in the store, there we go, 50 more shards, and then open them in that, again, one hour time frame. 24 hours after they have been put in the store. That's the only thing that I've heard constant rumors about it working for slightly better results, but at the end of the day, it's just, it's just luck. The thing that works best to get the characters that you need is to have a ton of gems. Like, this, is, this applies to real life as well. Uh, okay, one hard more shards, let's go. It's, it's piling up in there. So yeah, do, do you guys know how it's the best way to save money? What's the best way to grow money, to invest money, to have more money, make more money? And it might be like, no shit, but that's, that's as easy as it gets. Uh, but yeah, back to the video. A decent drop so far. Like, boy, when, when we get to Mahmoud's opening, every single thing in this video is going to be a decent drop compared to that one. Okay, another legendary drop. Let's go. 200, another one. This man got 200 two times. That's amazing. And some Heartbreak Harley Queen. We haven't seen her at all so far, as far as I remember. And he actually needs some to promote 7 stars. So, it'd be nice if he would, he would get some of that in the meantime. Okay, I think this scenario... No, it's the same opening. That's 50 shards. I believe the, it switched to another quality of video, but it didn't. There's some starfire in there, another gold, another gold. By the way, this is one of the very rare one uh, of opening one by one, so if you're not a fan of that, don't worry, we're gonna have uh, mainly opening uh, 10 at a time in this video. And yeah, that's uh, that's uh, EPI at 7 stars at this point. And another legendary drop, let's go. 50 more shards. Getting, getting towards 6 stars. Definitely getting towards, or is it, is it to, to 5 stars yet? I think it's 5 stars, definitely. It's 450 uh, to get it straight up to 4 stars, and uh, not really sure how much is from 4 stars to 5 stars, though. It should be slightly more, a little bit more. Okay, another legendary drop, let's go! 50 more! And another one! 50 more again! Some blame us. Nah, Blue Beetle. Boy, they really need to implement some way to do something with the extra shards that you have. Because I've seen people with 20k additional Swamp Thing shards. And they might be like, oh, but you can do something with your extra shards. You can donate them via link donation. Who's gonna want that man's 20,000 something extra shards? Like, be real here. More EPI in there that's gonna be useful for his link mates. And that's some Black Manta in there. I think that was 100. Okay, now going in full force with 10 of them here. That's just 50 shards. Man is looking for star promotion from 3 stars to 4 stars. So hopefully he gets it. Ah, that's not a good sign. That's not, that's not good at all. Though one more? Oh, just 50. That's not enough. That's not gonna be enough. Okay, we got 10 here. Got a few more gems. And there we go, there we go, there we go, four stars. At least that, at least that. Okay, so yeah, this is gonna be slightly lower quality, so apologies for that, this is the way it was sent. And again, thank you for submitting, we take everything, it doesn't matter. 
really what's the qualities. Yeah, that's 50 Black Manta shards, and that's the drops there. I, it's highly unlikely that that Black Manta is not unlocked at this point. Yeah, there we go. Actually, no. No, it's not unlocked. It's it's 25 more shards required for that. There's some swamp thing in there. The man, the man knows it's good. He clicked on it. There's 10 golds again. Oh, boy. So again, there's... There we go, 50 more shards. I was gonna say there's no way the man does not unlock. It's gonna also open some Brainiac chests. Like, this man opened anything, everything. Like, Brainiac, I would really not recommend opening chests because you can gem refresh his challenge if you want to speed up the sh getting shards process. But look, on the 50% sale, pretty much even the Brainiac chest is not, like, the worst thing in the world to get. Still wouldn't advise it, but yeah, 100 more there. Just needs one more to unlock Brainiac, bro. I did not think we will see the day. There we go, you unlock Brainiac, my dude. I did not think we would see the day where we would watch with excitement and somebody unlocks Brainiac from a legendary chest. And yeah, there's the shit Arkham Knight Batman chest that has weird shard drops with highly lower chances than the other chest, but the dude got lucky, unlocked it fast enough, and he's done with that. There we go, another dude attempt to unlock uh, Arkham Knight Batman, and he did. He had 160 shards already in terms of that. Oh, that's two full golds in a row. Three full golds in a row. This does did not start well. Four full golds in a row. Let's go. Oh, ho, ho, boy. Five. That's, that's five. That's five full golds in a row there. Yeah, this might be Mahmoud opening. Mahmoud's opening, though. I don't think so. Okay, so, no, it's not the one. It's six, it was six full golds in a row. And trust me, we're going to see worse than that. Okay, so here we have uh, 100 shards. He already had 30, most likely from the random chest they gave for uh, Halloween and all those events. Full golds again. You don't like to see that. Keep in mind, in this ones, there are actually lower chances to see shards at all. Okay, that's one uh, legendary shard in there. There we go, Arkham Knight will unlock you. Only need him at 3 stars, nothing more than that needed. There's 100 shards in there. So, decent start, but not decent amount of gems that this dude has. I actually, no, I thought that was 2k. He has, he has more than there, so he doesn't unlock. 75 more, let's go. One more drop and it's gonna seal the deal here. And that's a full gold. There we go, more gems wasted on that one. And again a full gold. Oh boy. And there we go, that's unlock. There's no way that did not unlock. Okay, that's um, full golds. I was actually not paying attention, excuse me, for that one. Okay, two legendary drops in here. 75 and a 50. Not bad, definitely not bad. 10 more there, 10 full golds. It happens. Where's my water, by the way? There we go. Oh, two legendary, 200, let's go! And the 51. Full golds. There we go, some more Manta, 50 shards. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay, that's 10 of them there, and no luck, sadly. But two legendary drops, and that's gonna be two 50s. Not bad. Another legendary drop, another 50. Slow and steady progress. That's full gold, sadly. Oh, two in a row. And the third one is gonna be a 15. Okay, that's uh, yet again a 15. Full gold again. Though I would say... I was gonna say this dude had average luck so far. But... The game... Is not really rooting for my opinion. But yeah, overall, I'd say this dude had so far average luck. Not the best, not the worst possible outcome so far. And never mind, he had above average luck. Bro, like, look at that thing. Look at that drop over there. That, that's a juicy drop. Okay, that's too legendary. In 200s, yeah, above average luck. Wouldn't call it the luckiest, but definitely above average luck. And 160 for API. Too bad they're kind of useless for him, as far as it seems, in terms of the amount of shards that he has. But that would have been something that some people would have been so happy with. 
Two more Legendary drops, 50 and the 50 again. And he's gonna stop there, that's all he wanted. Glad you got them, my dudes. That's a great start there. That over there is a great start. And 75 more. And another Legendary drop. That's just a 50, but that was more than enough to get the next star rating. Opening 10 more of them. Bro, it's so weird to see. Nowadays you see so many low-level accounts with so many gems because people get good stab drafters. And I'm glad that's a thing. I'm not glad that's not a thing for me, but I'm glad it's a thing for them. That's full golds. Sadly. And that's 50 more Black Manta Shards. That's fine. 100 more. Pretty good. He's gonna go for Arkham Knight Bedroom Chest. The, the garbage one. Hopefully he... Hopefully the chest is merciful on him, though the star doesn't seem too great. But at the same time, the amount of gems that he's got... Seems quite good. So, he just needs to throw enough gems at it. And it'll eventually happen. Putting 10 more of them. That's a 40 shard. Oh, he's looking for star promotion, not unlockment. I think that's the amount of shards you need from... Uh, 4 stars to 5 stars, if I'm not wrong about that one. Looking for star promotion. Dude. I mean, look, there is interior reason. If you don't have the resources necessary, it's not something you should prioritize or go out of your way to do. But you, sh you should, if you can, get Arkham Knight down to 7 stars to extend the stand duration to make sure that every single time uh, the last swipe of the Harbor Harley Quinn combo is going to be on the stand. That's one of the reasons why you would want him to a far higher star rating. Okay, opening 10 more, and that's going to be pretty much nothing. Again, 10 more, full golds. And 160, that's actually the biggest drop for some reason. Bro, why are they not fixing this garbage chest? Why are they not fixing it? It's been such a long time. With this, with this garbage chest with those weird odds and they're not fixing it. But yeah, 100 billion blast shards there. He's looking for star promotion from 3 stars to 4 stars and the 200 drop. That's a good start. That's definitely a good start. Again, full golds, fed rip. And that's another legendary. It's 50 though. 50 again. Slowly but steadily. And again, full golds. I was thinking about drinking game. Watch Sigval's chest, uh, chest opening video. And that's 250. That's lucky. Watch, watch one of those videos that I do. And every single time Sigvald says full golds, take a shot, but now nah, you'd, you'd end up to in, in a hospital, so... We'd rather not do that, okay? Don't try this at home. Okay, that's a 15 there. It's fine. That's two full golds in a row. Not, not a great start. Some EPA shards in there, but he seems like he's got more than he needs. 50 more. Don't complain too much about that one. And that is yet again full gold. 100 more. That's fine. And two legendary drops. Let's go. And that's 270. Not bad at all. Definitely not bad at all. I wonder how efficient it would be. I mean, oh, he's going for uh, dark side chests. I wonder how, le how efficient it would be to. Making just two mobile accounts, level them up a little, then uh, when there's a good sale, spend some uh, money on the uh, tab draw efforts if you're in a country that has good tab draw efforts, and then sell the accounts. Because people are getting crazy progress crazy fast nowadays, so hmm, would that be a lucrative business? Can't do it myself though, but it could be interesting. Okay, 100 more dark side shards. Again, dark side should not be a priority for you guys. But the man looks like he's got definitely the means to not need advice on that regard, my dudes. He's definitely got the means to never need advice on that regard. Okay, that's another dark side. 
Also, a little bit of a suggestion, my dude, if you're watching this, he's going for Brainiac 2 now. The only thing that you seem to be lacking on this account is credits. The thing you have in abundance is energy. And look, with crazy amounts of, like this of gems, if that's a constant thing, you don't even need gear materials and reforges because if you got tons of them, you can just buy the um, uh, gear pack from the uh, special offer side of things. And I mean, that's not the, the, the greatest deal, but when you get limitless gems pretty much or high amounts, it's, it's okay to get that. But if you need credits, go ahead and buy the sim packs every day from the store and keep farming normal Dr. Fate, normal tier 8 Dr. Fate to get some credits and some gears for some gear materials. That you'll get a lot of credits that way. That's something you could consider doing. But yeah, getting a ton of shards for my man Brainiac here. Okay, nah, this is the one, guys. This is the fat rip opening. This is the fat rip opening. Okay, that's four. That's that's three full golds in a row. Four. Five. Six. Bro. Seven, eight, nine, ten. How? How is that possible? Eleven, twelve, bro. Thirteen! Thirteen full gold openings, bro. What what is this? What? Why? How? How is that possible? This is why games usually have a pity system to avoid situations like this. To the extent if you open something that has a 1% chance and you open it 100 times and not hit that 1% chance, then the game is gonna take pity on you because of your unlock and give you that thing anyway. But yeah, that's 200 drop, but sadly we don't have that in Justice Mobile and bro. Fat rip, that's literally the most unlucky chest opening I have seen in my life and most likely the most unlucky one in, uh, in Justice Mobile history. Okay, for this opening, first up, good stuff. Good stuff, good shards, 200 there, we like to see that. Before we get more comments that are like, how does this dude have 78 mil chest? It's Spanish, I think. And uh, the, it's mil means thousand. You can see by the amount they decrease. But yeah, glad you, you got some decent drops in there of Ben Left. Definitely not a bad opening. Okay, that's gonna be, yes, one ledger in there. Okay, yeah, okay. Good stuff. That's full gold, sadly. But there's no way. Nah, just two of them. Amateur! Just two full golds. Bro, learn, learn from my man, Mahmoud. He's got 13 of them in a row. Bro, how can you be that unlucky? I'm so sorry for dude. But this man is getting some shards. This man is getting some solid shards in here. Okay, that's 50 more. And uh, he's gonna be done with that. Moving on to the Arkham Knight Baton chest. Okay, that's gonna be one shard drop in there. He's looking for star promotion as well. Again, we go all the way max with Mentor Ben Laughs, but you do you, my dudes. Yet again, it looks like one of those accounts that is beyond the point where he might need my advice. Okay, that's no way, there's no way that's not star promotion. Okay, now Sarah Lance going to Manta chest. Getting 50 shards for Manta. Then uh, getting out of this one. Getting 10 for Batman Laughs. Getting no Batman Laughs. Going to Arkham Knight Batman. Getting 10 of these. Getting full golds. Like, we got some very questionable practices over here. Though, we got two legendary drops in there. Oh, so he has uh, she or he or she? Maybe he's a she. Again, 
have uh, been left is unlocked. I would go full Manta at this point, but you do you. Okay, we got 15 there. That's that's definitely something. And 10 more for Manta and 10 golds. Look, my dudes. I can't help but look at that opening that we witnessed previously. Uh, yet again, thank you so much for submitting it regardless. But I can't help but look and think back at it and wonder. What have we accomplished? Not much. Well, shit. But yeah, 50, uh, 50 shards for Manta, 75 in there. Definitely solid progress here. That's full gold yet again. Full gold yet again. It glitched out a bit over there for a second. I thought I got something wrong with the video. It seems like it was not my bad. Okay, that's a Manta unlocked at this point. Now, are we looking for a star promotion? Yes, we are looking for a star promotion. We're 145 away from that. Okay, we're getting closer. Not getting closer with this one for sure. And that's another drop, that's another 50. Very, very close to four stars. Just one more drop, it doesn't matter how much it is. And that's full golds again, though there's some EPI. I think that's maxed out EPI. So unlikely he needs more. We got some openings here from Psycho Ward. Okay, that's gonna be a legendary drop here. And that's gonna be 50 shards. I was gonna go for a, uh, for a few tens of them. Two legendary drops in there. A 50 and a 50 yet again. Though, again, no, no reason to be mad about that one. That's, that's good stuff. And the full golds here, sadly. Full golds again. And that's two legendary drops. Let's go. 164 EPI, though, yet again. I'm not sure he really needs that. Uh, not too bad. Not too bad. Definitely sold enough progress. That's gonna be enough for four stars easily. But we want more, we're going to five stars. We're definitely getting there. He opening one of them, and that's gonna be sadly a fire storm. I was getting back to opening uh, ten of them. As I said, different people, different patterns. I don't personally think any of them work, but it, it doesn't hurt regardless. It doesn't hurt your odds. Okay, we got two legendary drops in there. 100 for Manta and 75 for Manta. Sold enough. Sold enough. Two more legendary drops. Let's go. Seventy-five for Manta and seventy-five yet again. He okay, opening ten of them. That's sadly full golds. Ten of them again, and ten more golds, my dude. Hold up. Ten full golds yet again. Fat rip. And two legendary drops. Let's go. Fifty and a hundred. Good stuff. Good stuff overall. Opening ten more. Oh no! That's not a good opening there. Looks like it's going all the way in with Black Manta. And yet again he's alternating between one and ten. Now he's going for more ones. Interesting. Interesting strategy, my dude. And uh, one dropped. 50 more shards. Slowly but steadily, nevertheless. Also, this dude, I think uh, I uh, cut that out of the video, or he cut himself, I don't really remember. But as far as I remember, uh, he upgraded his manta in between these star ups, so he could have um, the amount of shards needed uh, for the next star up on the display there. For himself and. Uh, now for us to see, so that's highly appreciated. Some something shards, so it's already a double legendary drop, some enraged bane shards, so you can't be too mad about that one. And 75 more mantis shards, 200 more. That's all that's needed, 
And boy, it's most likely it's unless it's all 50s or double 50 and the 70, there's no way this is not uh, a unlock. A star up, excuse me. And yeah, that's actually not star up. That was actually. <laughs> I was like, there's no way that's not star up. And they... Oh boy. I better shut up, you know? I better shut up at this point. Okay, he's got enough for 10 more. And more of them, he, he needs one more shard drop. That's not good. Oh boy, he was so close. He's got one more though. And that's a gold. Bro, he was so close. He was just, I think, 25 or something shards away from star up. But yeah, 10 of them here. 75 and 50. Oh, three of them. Oh boy. That's pretty good. Okay, 75 here. That's sadly just a work in Wonder Woman. On reverse flash, this is this is a new account as it seems. Oh boy! That's some good stuff. That's going in the thumbnail, my dude. That's going in the thumbnail. 50, 50, 75, and 75. That's that's good stuff. That's better than dropping a 200 one. Okay, some dark side charts in here. And for 10 more, 3 drops here for dark side shards, let's go, this man is destroying all the chests. Two hundred for Brainiac as well. Nah, there's no stopping this dude. Oh, he's, he's getting to the Manta chest, 100 Manta, that's a good start. Bro. Bro, look at this man's luck. There's literally nothing stopping him. And again. Hold up, is this a different dude? Because maybe their names were similar or something, but I thought he unlocked Manta already. But Manta is still not unlocked here, so uh, we'll see how that goes. Okay, that's some uh, reverse shards. Sub-Zero, that's fine. Some Predator Batman in there. Firestorm. It's terrible. Okay, opening 10 of them. Two legendary drops, let's go. And that's definitely unlocked, so at the very least that is sorted out. Oh boy, this, this man's got a metric ton of gems as well. He's not even bothering to wait for the Brainiac Challenge. He's like, nah, let's let's just keep that process. We're going all in here. I'm gonna have my Brainiac to six stars in, in no time. But he got quite unlucky so far. His Brainiac is three stars so far. That's gonna be um, another 50 shards. Yet again, I didn't think I'd see the day rooting for people to get their Brainiac to a higher star rating through chests. But here we are, and here we are in force. 200 shards dropped even. Oh boy. That's some good Brainiac drop there, my dudes. 100 more in there. It's a full gold, sadly. Opening 10 more. And that is... Not, there's some EPI in there. Okay, going for 10 more. There's a Brainiac. Going for 10 of them. There's full golds. Come on, boys, let's six star brain actor chest openings. That's that's the goal. Okay, that's uh, gonna be some more brainiac shards. Man is going places, his brainiac is going places, definitely. And more of them. That's another legend or a drop. 100. Let's go. There's yet another legendary drop in there. 50. Boy, th those are weird days. We might eventually get to the point where we see people buying the Brainiac gear chest because they're like... I mean, I know it's shit. I know they drop from the challenges, but... Who knows when the challenge is gonna come back? Why, why, why wait when you can go for that? Putting 10 more of them. That's full gold, sadly. Putting 10 more. Yet again, a 50 shard drop. And I don't think the previous one was full gold either. There was a small drop as well. 
another 50 shard drop. And 50 is kind of less, but considering the sale, kind of 100 shards is more or less the rate that you get for using uh, uh, that amount of gems for the challenge. 100 to 150, depending on the luck. You get some manta openings in here. Okay, that's that's a decent start, definitely. And that's full gold. That rip. Okay, that's more black manta in there. And yet again, more Black Manta. Let's go. Just 25 more shirts, and that's going to be an easy star promotion there. Okay, that's yet again full gold, sadly. And that's cement shirts. Full gold yet again. Bro, I still can't forget that cursed opening that Mahmoud did. Like, I just, I just wonder, how can you get that unlucky? How is that even possible, my dude? How is that the thing? Like, if, if you got that odds in your favor, I would say this man is straight up hacking. But why would you do that in your disfavor, bro? Bro, that is a mind-blowing shitty performance for that chest for you, my dudes. That fat rip. And yet again, we're close to the end of this one. So I want to say huge thanks for everybody that submitted here. For having a great time, hopefully, watching those videos. With all your guys' chest openings. Hope you enjoyed them. Thank you for sending them. And hope you got good luck and hope you got good... Uh, uh, let's say, uh, tap joy efforts and you're able to get a lot of gems. But yeah, all that being said, thank you so much for watching. Please do like. Comment, subscribe, and share if you enjoyed the video. Dislike it if you dislike it, don't get me wrong. Hit the bell button to get notified for every single upload that we post around here because I do post daily. Check out the stream channel, links will be in the description. Well, that being said, ladies and gentlemen, this man got lucky so far, and I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye!